Hello, it's Beth Roy from Be Styled coming to you live. I was feeling a little philosophical today and I was thinking about my business and about you guys and I wanted to share a quick little story that happened to me this past weekend. I was at a wedding. I think you all know I went to a wedding in Newport and it was beautiful and um, I had a little something happen. I was talking to this lovely woman though I did not know. I'd never met her before and we were chatting, making small talk and she was asked me what I did for a living. And honestly, I was about to tell her, you know, that I'm a stay-at-home mom. I honestly was not, I did not feel comfortable. I didn't know how an answer for her. I did not feel comfortable saying, oh, I'm a personal stylist. For one thing, I've never felt comfortable with that title. And here I am at this fancy schmancy wedding, I thought. She's going to look at me and be like, you're a personal stylist? Like, who are you kidding? <laughs> um, but anyway, I found myself saying to her that... I, I kind of joked about it. I said, I'm kind of a clothing coach. And she was like, oh, she's very interested. She's like, what's, what's that mean? And I, and I kind of told her, you know, I said, I, I live in the suburbs of Boston and I love to coach women and help real women with real budgets and real bodies figure out how to get dressed every day and feel comfortable and confident in their clothes. So that sort of thumbs up what my goal is here. I'm not a fashionista. I'm not you know, I like to follow the trends, but I'm not a high style, you know, Barney's shopping fashionista. That's not my thing. I have no problem with it at all, but it's just not, it's not my thing. Um, but I have found throughout the years that there are a lot of women out there um, who struggle with just the, you know, the basics of getting dressed. And um, maybe it's my degree in psychology. I just, I love, I love helping them. I really do. It sounds cliche, but I love seeing a woman go from feeling just so frumpy, to be honest. So women come to, so many women come to me and say, I feel frumpy. I feel I, no confidence when I get dressed. I've, I've kind of given up. I hear that all the time and there's nothing that makes me feel better than to, to sit with them and talk with them and figure out the basis of that feeling and how we can make it better. And it doesn't mean they have to lose weight. They have to get their hair done. It doesn't mean they have to spend a fortune on makeovers. It's, there are just certain small little tweaks you can make that, that, and I see the transformation and it can take an hour sometimes just in their closet or in a store or over the phone like this and see the transformation and see them look at themselves differently. And honest to God, nothing, that just makes me so happy. And um, the fact that I can make a little business out of it is just, it's just a dream come true. So the reason I can do that is because of all you who, you know, follow me and, and pay for my programs and, you know, read my blog and all that good stuff. So I just wanted to take a minute to thank you, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart for being there and, and being on this Facebook page and um, for your support and your friendship. I never in a million years dreamt that I would make so many truly close friends through this this business of mine from all over the country. I really, there's so many of you out there who I really feel like true friendship with. Um, and we might not ever meet in person, but I feel like that doesn't even matter as much as fun as it would be. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And I hope you all have a great day on my birthday <laughs> and um, do something fun and happy 4th of July next week and go just get dressed. Thanks again. Bye.